subscribe okay and hit that post notification bell and you know stay tuned for all of our other videos huh i said you guys know god damn abby ready always ready so guys today we're going to be all day we're going to be doing a taco bowl mukbang we don't know what we're talking about food is life and malia is here to join us on this mucky bangy oh she also has her own youtube channel it's really just my name malia de jesus and that's they had that sink and sink. How long yeah. have I been practicing that? The what? It was volume on point, everything. <laughs> Jesus. Ah, we are a mess, <laughs> actually. We really are a mess. We always talk over each other. Mm. All day. <laughs> we never let each other finish our sentences. Yeah, that was good. So, even... yeah, you already snow. What's up? When was the last time you posted, Malia? Mm. I don't even know. I'm just supposed to send it now. You're supposed to? Mm -hmm. What happened? No, no, like, who's coming tonight? Oh. What's it about? What are the people looking forward to? Um. Oh, you oh, got I had to review cool. on Kyle's daughter products. Hmm? They got like a box of those Kyle's daughters. Oh, Kyle's yeah. daughter. Bro, it's not even a hype. The hype is really. really? Yeah. It's good. It it's works. expensive. It's not expensive, but it's, and it sprays like. Like, it smells like perfume, but it smells like water. It's so weird. It doesn't like hold your like when I have curly hair. It's not, it doesn't hold it at all. Like, in this weather, it's just not making it help at all. So it's bad. Mm -hmm. Oh shit! This is a preview of the review, bro. I'm disappointed. Let's put a little. Yeah, like your first ball. You don't like that? It's good. What did you get? I got potatoes. Oh, we didn't even tell the people what we got. Oh, um, um, I got nachos and bullshit. I got. Cheesy fiesta potatoes and I got um gordita crunch. Fire. I don't even know what this is called. Crunch. Well, why doesn't this work there? Check. Check. I got. What I got? You got um cheesy fiesta potatoes. You gotta ask her. Uh huh. And I got um. A taco. A crunchy mm -hmm. taco with everything. Hard taco with supreme. I mean, yeah, whatever. And then I got a Baja Blast. You already know. Water down. How oh, I like it. What are you going to do from there? Because uh, I got a photo though. Mm. At the dollar store. I was about to say dollar tree. Mm -hmm. They upgraded me. Makes sense. For the free. You should ask for Really? Upgrade. I said, that smells kind of little. Can I get a medium? Like... She told me to wait for like five minutes. I was like, I just asked for the order and everything. <laughs> you know? That's because we made her good friend okay? What? They had her wait because she was making a drink. Yep. I hope I don't have the runs. I hope I do because I need to like leave. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, detoxing? Yeah. See, this is too much meat for me. Mm. Yes, no. Um. What was I gonna talk about? You got a topic for us? Mm -hmm. There's usually the one topic that I heard about, like, like with kids and like baby mamas and shit. Like, mm. that was over. That was um, it's just like it's so sad that like parents fight and can't be cordial for their child. Like, why does their personal whatever they have have to come in the way of their... Well, like, parents being separated or... Yeah, yeah. and make... Oh, yeah. And to be silly divorcing or whatever, or... Yeah. Separating. They always put them, like, the kid in the middle. And they don't understand how much... I'm a child of um, divorced parents. Mm -hmm. And they don't understand how much... Understand how much the kid suffers. Yeah, it all. really affects. It does. Especially if, like... Things that are being said right in front of them, too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. That's what they're arguing. Like, um, they go to school and can't focus because they're thinking about that. Mm-hmm. I used to go to my dad's on the weekend and my mom during the week. Always. I've never spent, like, a weekend, like, at my mom's. That's annoying. 
So I would never like see my grandmother or that side. That I'd be at my dad's. I was like, that was it. Like, mm -hmm. that was the like Sunday, one. seven o'clock, and Friday, seven. And you see, and then there's nothing wrong because obviously, like, you're not gonna. Yeah. If it's better for people to be separated, but like, it's just like not being able to work with each other. Mm -hmm. and, for the kid, you know what I mean? And you feel like, the kid always feels like they have to choose a side. Mm-hmm. Like, I just remember. I feel like my mom's side to be a Mm-hmm. But, it just sucks. And even more when they already have another significant other. Yeah. That makes everything worse. Mm-hmm. Oh my God. And that other parent is gonna hate them. They're gonna be like, don't like them, da -da, don't say dad, don't say mom. Mm-hmm. Like, they just get so pain. I feel like parents are more pettier than children. Like, OD. oh, OD. It doesn't even make sense. Because feelings are still involved. Mm -hmm. By at least one of them. <laughs> it's just mad annoying. The other one always likes the other one, so. It's not over, it, or you're jealous, or or, or or the one that moved on. Excuse me, the one that moved on first is the one that's making the other one's life a living hell. When you moved on first and you cheated or something. Yep. Mm -hmm. mm -mm. Exactly. Because they still want. And the then they don't allow you to even date. Like, they're yeah. jealous. Like, what kind mm -hmm. of shit is that? Selfish world. Did your dad have a. You have a stepmom too? No. I mean, not that I know of. According, according to everybody else, I do. Oh shit, I'm talking too much. <laughs> Nobody my dad introduced me to. Mm -hmm. At least I hope he gets somebody. Like I hope he does. Everybody deserves to have somebody. Nobody wants right. to be alone. Yeah, that's not right. And I hate when the baby mamas don't get along. Yeah, ever. So it's bad. always baby mama drama. Like future that has a million baby mamas. You just might as well get along. Right. Everybody knows he is shit. Like, and the mom always petty to the other baby mama. Mm -hmm. Like she's better. And they'll come out pregnant with her. No, so he watching his baby mom. Like, <laughs> mom He's got all types of shit. All races, nationalities. Yeah, crazy. He just means an Asian. No, yeah, he really shit. does. He got a whole tribe. Offset has all his shit under control. He got a couple baby mamas, he takes care of his kids. Everybody gets along. Cool. No, nah, remember when? Remember when he was first dating um Cardi? Cardi? Yeah, she had a little bit. Yeah, mama. she had drama mama. with the baby mm. mama because mm. the baby mama said that he wasn't seeing the baby because mm. he was working. Mm. Oh, like, bro. No, no, no. <laughs> he wasn't seeing you. So. Right. <laughs> he wasn't giving you no more money. Well, I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. He was on Cardi B track on. And that she ain't a good stepmom. Jealous, livid. You're livid because I ain't you. And nobody knew about you since so now. Not really there. And he really made a song for Cardi. Yep. And you're that nigga, you're that nigga. I can't believe they got back together. She was blasting him. Yo, she was making <laughs> <the streets. laughs> Her whole album. That's how you know it's real. Mm-hmm. You think it's so messy. You? No, that's it's my mess. Oh. I'm not messy. Yeah, oh, I'm already done. That's that's real crazy. I eat mass slow, you know. Mm-hmm. Mash it will get cold before I finish. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm still being I don't even know who you are now. You got a body. It'll be a party in my stomach too. Maybe asshole. <laughs> Yo, fat. That was a good topic. You already know that's gonna like rumble. Can you guys just sit there for a <laughs> Cause I wanna eat a piece. I I'm watched you pour hot sauce all over it. I need. I like, don't know why you're not expecting it. I need it on each bite. Of course. And when you ask us the rims later, I don't want to hear nothing. I want to have the mom. What? Because yeah, that's, then that shit stays in your tummy. Like, I'd rather have it come. i rather have it come out than hurt my stomach. Oh, it's gonna mm -hmm. hurt. Yeah, cause I'll, cause if they don't just be constipated. <laughs> cause shit like this never will sound well. Really? Not once. There's not any fast <laughs> food that has ever gotten down. So really? I'd rather poop the shit out. Exactly. 
go on detox and go fast food. Brand new, for real. If you're being a little constipated, <laughs> Taco Bell's number one. Oh, Laxative right here. Laxative. Like, I always poop with, with Taco Bell. So I'm talking about what? pooping and you guys are eating. But, I get um anxiety when I eat fast food, so tonight I'm not gonna Why? Eat. I don't know. Like, I just can't breathe. Fatty. Anymore. It's too fatty. I feel crazy. Mm. And I'm eating it at this time. Yeah, McDonald's is so greasy. Ooh, I love McDonald's so is what gives me the most anxiety. Yeah, like, like, McDonald's will be making you feel rough. funny. Like, yeah, your I feel like I can't and breathe. Shit. Yeah, it's literally every single every single time. It's weird. Mm, it's nice. That food's been sitting there forever. You know Yo, how it will sit in your stomach for like days before mm -hmm. you like take it out. Yeah, and a hot dog. Yeah. But that's donuts really sleep. <laughs> no, that's why Charlie's stomach is huge. <laughs> you think it's because I was feeling sick? Because I was eating, there was a point where I was eating hot dog. A lot, often. I can't eat a hot dog right now. No. I'm not going to be able to eat a hot dog in a while. Why? Oh, oh. Let's say out of nowhere, okay, the husband goes and decides to take the car because the car is under their name. Like. We're fighting. I'm going to break that all the windows. That's got a tracking thing on it. And their and their kid and you I'm have breaking kids. Wait, so they, they took the kids in the car? No, not the kids, but like that's your only car, and you have kids, and you, you have gotta kids that have to, to go to school, and you have to do this, and like just because that car is under their name, mm -hmm. they decide to take it, but they already have their own car too. Oh, they, and they took both of them. Yeah, that's crazy. You know what? That's I'm crazy. talking shit. I'm talking shit, saying I'll do this, I'll do that, but. Take it. If you, if his like, karma's about yeah, to be crazy. Like if you feel that low enough, enough to like, <laughs> not give transportation to your kids, that's hard. It's true. Like, yeah, that's the type of person I, I, you have to marry them. Regardless, you have to figure it out. It's true. So, so that should, should never. But that's like also a, a a a lesson for the other person to know that you need to have to truly have your own thing sometimes, mm -hmm. like like your own car under your own name. You know, because things like that can really happen as much as you feel like, okay. Yeah, but too, imagine if, imagine if, um, you know, for example, my parents, when they were married, you know my shit my dad took out under my mom's name and fucked up my mom's credit? Ish, yeah. So what if you can't even do it because as a couple, you know, you, you look out for your, your nigga all the time, like, I'm not here, maxed out my credit cards or whatever, and now you don't have credit, so... Whatever is his duty. Yes, nigga, take it out under your name. The fuck. Mm -hmm. yeah. And now you guys are broken up, and then he does some crazy shit like that, or she does some crazy shit. And when you're married, you always like they always split half. Yeah, like, I if you got half of one. nothing, you always get half. Like no matter what, you can start like a business in your name, and they'll get half of it. And that's all your hard work. Like that's so crazy. Oh shit, nah. I'm yeah, gonna, yeah. Like the girl, the freaking. Especially if you don't sign a prenup. Prenup, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That Amazon maybe like she's up, but I'm Ooh. sure like everything was um, under his name and shit. But I, I'm sure they were married for so long that she invested in that shit too. I know, of course, of course. Like that's mad nights that she wasn't with her husband and shit. That I'm sure, I'm sure she put in work. Cause like if if my nigga has um, a business, obviously I'ma help him. So that's just mm. mine, my nigga. Why well, not? That's mine too. Yeah. Cough yeah. it up, bro. Your my business, business is my business. Right, right. Right. <laughs> What's mine is mine. Chill. What's yours is mine. <laughs> What's mine is mine. What's yours is ours. Exactly. Especially if I'm putting in the work too, though. And th that's what the judge will go by. Like, oh, like, have you helped in any type of way? Then, uh, yeah, like, what? people are saying, oh, wow, she, he got her. She got him for his money. But people are not thinking about all the years she spent with that nigga. Suffering. Mm -hmm. That Amazon took 10 years to get up. Like, to... To actually be something 10 years that's 10 years of her fucking life of the struggle and someone else is getting half of that she, he better give her half that's the area he didn't seem to fight it at all that's crazy that he had that amazon idea years ago 10 years bro that's why 10 years how did it start coming like popping i should look up at the story i think what got him popping was that two-day shipping to me <laughs> Just to me, Prime was new. Mm, Prime just yeah. started. Cause I was an eBay head. I used to always order everything on eBay, phone case eBay, everything mm -hmm. eBay. Amazon was there, but Amazon was always more pricey. 
so I would still go to eBay. But then when that Prime came along, then Prime TV, you could watch all your shows, everything on. I got that. Let me just lie. For power. You know, I haven't even watched power. You I know. So, you still need to watch even, power. Exactly. No, you need to watch power. That's hard. It's a lot of it's mad season. That's really crazy. That's max. Only six. Well, how many for like each episode though? Mm -hmm. It'd be right now up. though. Right now it's fire. Every episode. They still got Trey Songz doing the intro. No hell. No. <laughs> Not even Trey Songz with that shit. <laughs> it was like Joe, we need you back. <laughs> yeah, that was bad. <laughs> He didn't even like it himself. But he said, he didn't even have like a, a say in it. He just let them change it back right away. So he told Fuji Sarah for the job, like, bro, no, 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 no. Don't, don't come for me in this predicament. <laughs> <laughs> just not my stomach, right? Why are you chill? Bubble in. Let me tell you this mm -hmm. quick story before we move forward. Guys, so this morning, I had such a fucking bad morning. So I go to Dunkin, right? And I call my co-worker to see if she wants a coffee. She goes, yeah, I want a, ice, a medium ice, whatever. So All right, cool. So I pull up to Dunkin Donuts and I said, can I get a small hot chocolate? Can I get a medium iced coffee, caramel? And can I get a toasted croissant? Boom, boom, boom. The lady says, yeah, she's saying everything, like with toasted croissant, all these things, right? Then I go to pay and I see a hot coffee and I see the small hot chocolate and I'm like, I was like, ma'am, that's not iced coffee. <laughs> and then she's like mad and she changes it. And I'm like, it's so early, like I can't <laughs> see right now. I can't see right now. It was, it was six, ma'am. It was six, it was like 6, 18 in the morning. Oh, so she was still sleeping. Yeah. And then, she <laughs> had just got there. You know, then, then, okay, then she's giving me my stuff. And I'm like, honey, where's the toasted croissant? Mm -hmm. She's like, all I see is the, the uh, hot chocolate and iced coffee. So you forgot. <laughs> and I was like, oh. <laughs> I was like, <clears throat> I was like, get us together. I was like, okay, okay. And I think because I was gonna be late, that's the thing. I was gonna be late if I waited and complained mm. and waited and all that shit. So then I get to the, the school, boom, I'm like, at least I got the fucking hot chocolate. Taste the hot chocolate, and it's water! It's <laughs> water! It's water! And I was just like, but just like water? So, it tastes like water, like so it had a water hint down. of chocolate. So they only put a tiny bit. Yeah, they just put some powder. You know, you know, it. you know how they do it. Like the hot chocolate machine, it's it's with water and chocolate. That's mm -hmm. what it's made. And there's no. It was chocolate. probably at the bottom. So they, <laughs> so it's fresh in the morning. So probably mad water came out. Oh at yeah, you right. They probably had just changed mm -hmm. it or something, and they gave you mad. Water. I was living, and then I'm just like, are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? And I had only three hours of sleep. <laughs> so I was hurt. And then I'm like, I'm gonna call. I don't care. I'm gonna complain. You was that? I was that. that. Cause I was. Oh, I was donuts. I was living. Cause I also spent five dollars in change. <laughs> so so much cheap. I could have just got a water bottle. Right now I'm on the time of my spending. Mm -hmm. So I spend money for watery hot chocolate. Like, I didn't spend my money for no, watery hot chocolate. Nothing. So I call them, right? No, 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 no. I call them, <laughs> and then I'm like, hello, and some young, young and take gets the phone like some kid. He's like, hi, and I'm like, is your manager on duty? And he goes, I mean, <laughs> not right now, but what can so I So they help? got no manager. Yeah, man. that's, he's like, what is this and I can help you with? I was like, okay, all right. I was like, okay, so I was here that I was there this morning, and you know, Duncan, you guys are a lot of people start like start of the day, like a lot of people come to you at the beginning of their day, so you know that can determine how their day's gonna go. All right, <laughs> your Literally. customer service at your at your place was horrible. I was like, I ordered, I ordered a hot chocolate, I ordered this, I didn't get it, and they didn't even give me back what I what I needed. He goes, and he goes, we don't even have a drive through here. <laughs>
check it, look at it, but it, it was a whole different steak. And I was Did like, you call the right one after? No, you don't, because I was already a lot. <laughs> that was OD. Yo, I did that with orders on one. I'm sorry, guys, <laughs> blabbering, but yo. All right, cool. But anyways, cool. guys. Damn. Did you end up getting a coffee after? Huh? You end up getting a coffee after? No, she was already out. After I went home to take a nap and I went to the mm -hmm. same Dunkin' Donuts, though, right? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> this story's this story not ending. So, <laughs> I didn't even, I was like, you know what, I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna complain. Whatever. I know you're It's a new start. It's a <laughs> Boom, order the medium coffee now, medium iced coffee. Go to the window. <laughs> it's a small. <laughs> God. I was like, who's working? Who's working today? <laughs> I need a medium and she changes, she changes it. But I'm like, yo, your people need to get it. Oh, I know it was that one. Okay. They always fuck up there. Anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching this video. <laughs> the ranting. And make sure you guys don't go like, to that Duncan. Don't, don't go, go to the Duncan, Duncan at Elmwood. Probably. Don't do it. The one there, I'm, I'm on the yo. market. <laughs> oh my god. But thank you guys so much for watching. Please be sure to comment, like, share, and subscribe, and we will see you guys next time. Six million for being with us. Of course. Fucked up. <laughs> Bye. We're gonna do another Bye. video. Never have ever. Peace.